on immigration, why don't we reopen Guantanamo to have them reopen until their status is decided instead of cash the release? I'm not sure I agree with that, uh, putting, putting the illegals in Guantanamo. I, what my bill does, I have a bill in Congress that is sponsored by myself, the chairman of the Judiciary Committee, the chairman of Homeland Security, and the chairwoman of the Border Security Subcommittee. So it's the four immigration heads in, in Congress. And what we do is we make sure that there's no more catch and release. That what we do is we, we end the catch and release practices. We send illegals back who are caught here at the border. We build a wall. We ensure that there's interior enforcement in the United States so we can catch people in the interior of the United States. But it also does something with the DACA population. It legalizes the DACA population and it also helps uh, create a new program for ag workers in the United States. It's been endorsed by President Trump. It's the bill that he wants to pass in Congress and we are trying to get it passed out of the House. You still have a group of moderate Republicans that are not for it because it's too strong on enforcement. Imagine that. Republicans are not for it because it's too strong on enforcement. And we're trying to make sure that we can get enough Republicans to vote for it. But the President has endorsed this bill. That's why the Brad Little ad is so laughable, is that the one person who has been working on illegal immigration, working with the President on stopping illegal immigration is me. That's what you try to do in politics, I guess, is to try to attack your opponent's weaknesses. But what I told you in the beginning, I would never lie about my opponents. And I think it's shameful that they're doing that in, in this race. Mm -hmm. How about it's not Guantanamo itself. Guantanamo contains Camp Chocolate. Correct. Camp, and that holds about 20,000 people. Yeah. And that's what they dealt with in the 90s. Just yeah. to tell your process. Put yeah, but, but we have 12 million illegals in the United States, and I, I would rather just send them back. It, it, what my bill does is it ends the catch and release practice practice because it gets rid of the loopholes in the law that allow these people to remain in the United States illegally for a long period of time. So that's what I would rather do. I don't want to be housing anybody. I just want to send them back to, yeah, 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 yeah.